Welcome to this Palms video about soil and plant growth. We are going to look at the two main basic components of soil, humus and rock, and how they affect plant growth. Home compost is pure humus. Materials like vegetable scraps and shredded paper are broken down by microbes and worms into rich organic material. Can you see the worms in this compost? For our experiment, you will need sand, which is weathered rock, compost, which is humus, an empty container, three small pots or containers with drainage holes in them, gloves for working in soil, and fast-growing seeds. I've used cress. For safety, you should wear gloves when handling compost and sand. Wash your hands when you've finished setting up your experiment. To start your experiment, mix equal amounts of sand and compost in the empty container. Place the compost, the mixture, and the sand into labeled pots. Plant your seeds. I'm sprinkling on the cress seeds, then covering them with a very thin layer of soil. Gently water your plants and place them in a sunny location. Water them again whenever the plants get dry. Check your pots each day and record your observations of plant growth. Do all of the plants sprout at the same time? Are some taller than others? Do some look healthier than the rest? In my experiment, the plants grew tallest and healthiest in the humus. Humus and soil helps us grow healthy food plants. This is why gardeners and farmers add compost to improve soil. Thanks for watching this Palms video. For more fun, hands-on science activities, visit the Palms website at palms.edu.au.